continuing with reoptics in this video reoptics part 6 we will be talking about angular dispersion and dispersive power the contents of this video are dispersion angular dispersion and dispersive power now what's dispersion the dispersion of light is the phenomenon of splitting of array of light into its constituent colors or wavelengths the band of colors formed is called the spectrum rainbow in nature is formed due to dispersion of white light this is the rainbow formed by dispersion of white light due to the rain droplets Array of white light gets dispersed into its constituent colors or wavelengths appearing as a band of colors from violet to red. This band of colors is called the spectrum of white light. We know that colors are violet, indigo, blue, green, yellow, orange and red in that order. The colors of white light which we obtained they can be recombined by using an inverted prism to get back white light as you can see in this diagram the seven colors violet indigo blue green yellow orange red on entering the prism they recombine and we get back white light now what's the cause of dispersion the deviation produced by a given prism by given prism me, we mean the prism of a particular angle and a particular material it depends on refractive index of the material of the prism since refractive index mu depends on wavelength or color of light different colors violet indigo blue etc they are deviated through different angles resulting in dispersion uh, this is to be read as angles the same can be explained using Cauchy's equation as we will see according to Cauchy's equation the refractive index is related to wavelength lambda as mu is nearly equal to a plus b over lambda square plus c over lambda 4 Remember this is an approximate relation where A, B and C are constants for the given material. The refractive index in this relation has lambda in denominator. So larger wavelength implies smaller refractive index and vice versa. We have lambda red that is wavelength of red larger than wavelength of violet. So, by Cauchy's equation, the refractive index for red color will be less than refractive index for violet color. Also, deviation delta is A into mu minus 1, which implies larger mu, larger delta. Therefore, violet deviates more than red. So, violet goes closest to the base and red remains farthest from the base resulting in the dispersion violet deviates the most and red the least resulting in dispersion further let's see what is angular dispersion you know we have seen that white light after passing through the prism gets dispersed that is various colors get separated if you extend violet ray and red rays backward the angle between violet and the red emergent rays is what is known as angular dispersion this angle here shows angular dispersion it is equal to delta v minus delta r that is deviation for violet color minus deviation for red color using the expression for deviation as mu minus 1 into a you can write the relation delta v minus delta r as this or simplification leads you to mu v minus mu r into a since different colors get deviated through different uh, 
angles we define mean deviation for yellow color because its wavelength is in the middle of the visible part of the spectrum another important term for a prism is dispersive power the dispersive power is the ratio of angular dispersion that is delta v minus delta r to the mean deviation that is deviation produced by the for yellow color so dispersive power noted by omega is given by delta v minus delta r over delta y or mu v minus mu r over mu v minus 1 this is how we define dispersive power remember the dispersive power should be high for a prism if you want to study the spectrum that's why for spectral studies we make use of dense flint a type of glass which is a higher refractive higher dispersive power however for a spectral lens the colors should not be separated so the lens material should always have a low dispersive power thanks for watching the video should you have any feedback feel free to write to ikg54 at yahoo.co.in visit this site www.physicspectrums.com for more topics you may like the video you may share the video should you feel like here in this site you will get videos, notes, assignments, useful revision problems, CBSC papers, solved and unsolved etc. Thanks again.